Good uh, afternoon, morning, something, YouTube. Um, huh, it is December 21st or 20th, Sunday anyways. My interesting, my weekend got real interesting last night. I, uh, well, you saw me working on the red pickup in here in the last video and uh, got that all done, ready to go. Figured I'd pull the, what we call the naked lady in here. Get the spare motor for Oscar jerked and tranny. And uh, get this pickup ready so that guy that wants them can come and get them. And uh, about the time I got the front clip off for Oscar and radiator, bumper and back window for my red and black pickup, I got called in to work. Oh, as a side note, Kayla locked herself out of the 57. So that was another thing to tack on the list of things to do. Um... It's easy to do, it's got those door handles that you pull, you know, and as you get out, if you catch it on your coat, it'll lock it, you know. But uh, anyways, so, got called into work, and that was about midnight. Um, so I hop in my trusty red and black pickup, and head on into town. Well, I was feeling pretty good, I'd put the good tires on it, you know, I was just feeling kind of frisky, you know. Get to the four corners, you know, where I turn on to 16 and uh, cut that bitch loose. Uh, smoked the tires to about 55, kicked third, and it went boom, boom, and shook like a son of a bitch. So I'm going, what the fuck? Motor was still running good, so I knew it wasn't the motor. Um, hopped up underneath it, and you guys will get to see the carnage. I'll, uh,. <laughs> I'll build the suspense here because it's bad. It's it's real bad. But thankfully, I've got all the extra parts I need. So that, and then I didn't get home until 5.30, 6 o'clock this morning from work. And uh, now, then we got my pickup pulled home here just about 20 minutes ago we got here with my pickup. And so now I'm going to roll some projects in and out of the shop here. First things first, I'm going to finish up what I'm doing. Can't uh, stop progress on account of my stupidity and childishness. So we'll get the motor and tranny jerked out of this, get it set outside so it's all ready to go for that dude. Then we're going to pull Oscar in and we'll do a full round of service on Oscar. Got to get my sister's car in because I'm going to drive that for a while. Uh, probably haven't mentioned it to you, but the head gasket blew on the Lincoln. It's a common Lincoln thing with the 3.8s. Um, but I don't think I'm going to fix that one. I think I'm going to focus on the black one. Uh, so I'm going to drive Joyce's little Volkswagen Golf for a while, which is cool. 50 miles a gallon. I ain't complaining too much. But uh, And then in the meantime, we're going to fix my pickup. So while I'm driving that. So we got plenty of work to get done and uh, you guys can just follow along. Well YouTube I got everything uh, got everything unbolted and such and now it's time to jerk it out. So here we go. is a heavy son of a bitch too.
Well, kids, there it is. The 6.9 in all its glory. I've only been need meaning to get that done for about four years now. So at least it's pulled now so we can set it aside and uh, get this thing out of the shop and roll the next one in. Next in will be Joyce's Volkswagen Golf. Get some tires on that and then a couple other things we got to get done. But, yeah, so, anyways, let's, uh, ah, uh, there's been some moisture down in there. Well, anyways, let's go ahead and have Well, a, we just got some simple service jobs now. Got the oil changed in this one. Kayla's uh, $300 cutlass will be next. And then we pulled Joyce's car in here and we're going to put some tires on it because the back tires are in pretty, pretty awful piss poor shape. So, got this one done. I didn't take a video of it because it's just me changing the oil. Pretty simple stuff, straightforward anyways. But, for every end, uh, since my pickup is down, I guess we'll be using this thing for a while. So I put some power service in the tank and change the filter and I haven't been using this one much. It's not because it's, you know, not reliable. I mean, this is one of the few times you'll see it in the shop is when we bring it in to service it. Of course, I got I got to put that front clip and radiator in it one of these days because this one's all... I'll show you what happens when you hit too many bumps way too hard. This right here is what happens. And so... Um, and this over here. So now the hood won't latch right. And then the radiator kind of flops in here. And the shroud hits right there. So we're going to pull the front end back off. And <clears throat> my 150 pound bumper will pull that off the front. And get the whole front clip replaced and repaired. And uh, yeah, then maybe our hood will latch right. So at any rate though, enough of me babbling. Let's get another okay. car. Okay, next up, the Cutlass. Yeah. Well, yeah, this one's got one of those filters that's in a really nice place to get to. I like that. But, at any rate, let's, uh, I think we're going to have to jack this one up a little bit. And then we'll uh, get the oil changed on it. <clears throat> boogity boogity. Uh, well, there it is. Last project in the shop tonight. Nothing major, just uh remounted four tires I went from a 155 60 or no 155 80 excuse me to a 185 70 so they're substantially wider and just a little bit taller shouldn't make a huge difference but it's definitely noticeable now instead of looking like a uh, now instead of looking like a wheelbarrow it looks like a wheelbarrow with big tires but now you saw these tires here just a second ago and these ones are actually in really good shape these are damn near brand new these were the front ones but the back ones you can see here cord showing and they went oop 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 shaped kind of like an octagon you know so it doesn't roll real well <laughs> so it was time to get them replaced phones ringing though so oh well, nobody I know anyways so there, that's the last of it. I'm not going to get to my pickup tonight because I got to get to bed yet, and because uh, I got to work tomorrow. But we will get after that pickup tomorrow, after work and after we feed cows. So, till then, I bid you all adieu.